Hey, what's up, guys, and welcome back to another episode of Let's Play FTB. Now, I've gone to the nether, I've gathered some materials in order for us to build some blast furnaces. Two of them. So we can skip the cruel and evil Bronze Age as is forced upon us by the evil Greg Dick. Due to the steel ingots that we found, I was able to make a flint and steel, which does require a steel nugget. And I was able to go to the nether and acquire materials. In case you're wondering how I got to the nether without a diamond pick, it was because of the igneous extruder. I simply made obsidian. It's one bucket of lava to one bucket of water, and it makes obsidian blocks for you. And that's how I made the portal. And my pressure plate. Now, that we've done this. I'm gonna be frank with you guys. I already recorded part of this episode and realized that it wasn't recording, so I'm just starting over. Now, to the first thing on our agenda so that we can get started off relatively quickly and productively is diamonds. That's right. Gonna mine our first diamonds on camera. Alright. Two, three. Is there any more? Any more? Any more? No? Crap. Well then, that sucks. But we got three diamonds, which means we can accomplish exactly what I was planning to accomplish. Hopefully. Alright. Now. I need two sticks. And some iron. Do this do and we have a chest. So we can do this. We get a piece of redstone. And we need to smelt up some smooth stone, which can be accomplished quite easily. Okay. In the meantime, while that's smelting up, let's do this. Resources miscounted. Probably because I was thinking of making four furnaces. There's a stone. Now we can make a turtle, which is like so. We can make a computer. Throw that in there. Give him a chest. Wrap some iron around it. And we have a turtle. Now we can make a diamond pick. And now we have. Mine turtle. Number one. Label set mine turtle number one. Yeah. And now we grab our bucket. Refuel. That's gonna get annoying quickly. Let's put Buckets of fuel in you. Ten buckets of lava, so we have ten thousand fuel. I know this isn't very productive, but at the moment, this is the best our tech can do. I could write a turtle program, but I don't think you guys want to see me write code on screen. If you do, let me know. Okay. Now we can take you. Let me jump through the portal, turn into a bat. Now, let's set up some auto mining, which I've already prepared. 
prepare the supplies for. Yeah. Right here looks like a good spot. Alright, so we sit down the turtle and we get our iron chest, which is just a chest surrounded by iron. And we get our item ducks, our opaque item ducks, which is just lead and tin. Alright, we install a servo. No, bad. Use some barrels. servo, set redstone to ignored, wrench that so that it's output mode, and then we type in excavate 10. Excavate 10. Thank you. And he will dig a 10 by 10 hole all the way to bedrock from his current level, which means we will have resources and hopefully more diamonds. That's done. It's a map creeper. Gonna hate those things. Uh, those are real creepers. I'm sorry. Come in aside. I'm sorry. I'll leave you alone. Actually, let's just sleep. Oh. Derp. Before I forget, I made a rapier and a shovel. The blade is made of iron, and so is the spade. With obsidian for reinforced three. Basically just basic tech tools. So I could go mining in the nether and not have to worry about stupid things like shovels breaking. Blast furnace from Railcraft is a three by three by four tall structure, and it converts iron into steel. One, two, three, four. Yep. Boom. Blast furnace. We're going to need a lot of fuel to burn. I was scared there for a second. Yeah! I was like, oh, did I miscount? Alright. Now that we got that, we can put some iron into this. And no, we can't. Because in order to make steel... In order to make steel in these, we need coal coke. Which I need to make a coke of. So that would be fun! Won't it? <sighs> Did you know that due to Greg Tech's evilness, instead of just taking four glowstone to make a glowstone block and a compressor, because it's Greg Tech, it's like, oh, use a compressor. Oh, look, you need nine. You need nine now. Thank you, Greg. Thank you. Gosh. Anyway, well, I guess we can start doing some of this. Ooh, that sound. Doesn't that sound wonderful to turn into a bat? Alright, we'll just throw all that copper in there, and then we'll get cooking up. Now, 
if you mix copper and tin, you get bronze in the smeltery, which you don't want to do by accident, assuming because you cannot take them apart. Or see? What do you have on you? It's a hat that's riding you, apparently. Hmm. I see. Interesting. Anyways. Um, I don't believe I mentioned these before, but I found some ender lily seeds. You can grow them on grass or dirt or in stone. These grow really, really slowly. I mean, really slowly. But once they grow, they'll give us ender pearls. And of course, an ender lily seed. Now, sometimes, sometimes, they'll give us another ender lily seed. It's very rare. I don't know if that's a bug or not, but I know they do. Because I started out with 10 before and ended up with 15. And another file of mine. So we've been growing some rubber trees in order to get some rubber for industrial craft. Oh, look, we're smelting copper. Here, get in there. Copper gravel just works like copper. Okay, we don't need you, we don't need you, and we really don't need you. <coughs> Where's my tree tag? And my hatchet. I made a hatchet as well. It's all iron. And it just tears through leaves. And when it tears through leaves like this, it doesn't use any durability. Which is awesome. to society, therefore it was exterminated. I don't hold that. It's just a tree, it's just a tree, it's just a tree. I don't hold that belief for people. I actually really am against cruelty and war and everything, but besides that, we won't get into that. That's political. I'm a nice guy. I don't believe in killing people. Like that. Like extermination stuff like that. I don't believe in that then. No. No. Okay? No. Don't even think that. Okay. So the next item on our agenda. Hmm. I wonder. Oh, yep. Our copper's done. Gonna throw some in there. We do want a few pieces of bronze. Why are air shards in here? Doesn't make any sense. So, okay. I'll put in... Yeah. Screw it. 1, 2, 3, 9, 12, 24. Yeah. Get some bronze out of this. So we'll do that, and now we'll have some bronze. And we have our other portal gun. I guess I'll give you guys another tour real quick. Just let me turn into bat mode and let's hop in the nether portal and away we go. So. Oh god, it's a Pahimar! Okay. I wonder if he has headphones on because he's jamming. It seems. Come on! Okay. That wasn't concerning at all. I thought my entire nether had just disappeared before my eyes. It was like, oh no. I'm gonna have to regen this now. Mmm, flesh. From biomes of plenty. 
What is this used for? Chunk of flesh. What are our uses? We can make flesh blocks, so we can make rotten flesh if we have poison extract. Poison extract is made from poison ivy in an empty jar. That's counterproductive in every way. Ugh. Alright, guys. Let's go to the Nether Fortress, because nobody cares about anything else but the Nether Fortress. This is a Nether Fortress. It's nice. There's also a Wasp Hive from Biomes of Plenty. Oh, there's several Wasp Hives in this Nether, actually. Anyway, I mine. I dug up a whole bunch of soul sand over there. And over here, I just dug this out to get all my... Nether bricks. Ah, blazes. I'm sorry, I don't like you. Go away. But yeah. Alright, guys. I'm sorry about this episode if you didn't like it. It's because I filmed half of it, like I said. I didn't mind the diamonds, but... As far as, like, crafting the turtle and crafting all that stuff to mine with the turtle... Yeah, he had done that on camera. And then I realized it wasn't recording. I was like, oh, that's wonderful. Thank you. So apparently whenever I record in full screen mode, it doesn't like to. That's not concerning at all. I'm just going to leave that be. Alright guys, I'll see you in the next video.